You know there's a lot of history going on here. It's not just about today, and it's not just about what happened two weeks ago. It's important to keep this memory alive for future generations. We're all trying to work today for gun control, but we want the future generations of our families, of our children, of our community, to remember what took place here by collecting the items that are being left at these memorials for these children and the three adults that were, were taken from us um, and displaying them in future years for many years to come, um, this memory will not die and we won't allow it to die. I don't know that the shock's worn off. We live in a small community, it's a bedroom community, it's a very upscale community, and I don't think we ever expected that in this type of environment that would have taken place. Um, so I don't think the shock's worn off. Um, but, but moving forward from here, preserving that shock, making sure people don't forget that shock, memorializing all 17 people, the children and the adults, as well as all the people that were in that school and the first responders that took place in saving this environment um, is extremely important.